missiles which were preparing to launch against ships in the Red Sea. The British Prime Minister Rishi Sunak said the joint airstrikes were in self-defence, that Houthis' attacks on shipping had put lives at risk and were having economic consequences. The White House has warned that its retaliatory airstrikes on Iran-linked targets in Iraq and Syria are just the beginning, not the end of its response. Iran denies involvement, but its affiliate, the Islamic resistance in Iraq, has claimed responsibility. Terry and Paws. He'll talk to Arab nations about what happens the day after a deal is struck. And we're told Mr Blinken plans to talk directly to countries in the region about the scope of US actions taken in retaliation for the deaths of those US service members last year. In uh, uh, what is happening elsewhere in the region, we've seen that there have been more uh, American airstrikes targeting the Houthis in Yemen. Uh, the Americans are saying that this is about uh, guarantee. Uh, come in the next uh, few days. We saw the first wave of airstrikes targeting Iranian interests in Iraq and Syria on uh, uh, the weekend. And I think uh, the focus now is on Iran and its proxies and how or if.